हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू स्टैंडर्ड नाइन्थ मैथमेटिक्स चैप्टर वन नंबर सिस्टम दिस इज लेक्चर नंबर इलेवन लाइन लास्ट लेक्चर वी हैव सीन दैट हाउ टू रिप्रेजेंट द रियल नंबर ऑन द नंबर लाइन यूजिंग सक्सेसिव मैग्निफिकेशन सो रिलेटेड टू दैट वन एक्सरसाइज यू हैव एक्सरसाइज वन पॉइंट फोर you have to solve that understanding in that question one we have visualize 3.765 on the number line using successive magnification so number we have 3.765 this number you want to show on the number line and we have to use successive magnification so successive magnification one by one we have to show the number lines having 10 10 parts in it so first we will show here One line of 10 centimeter again the same matter will apply. 10 centimeter line second you draw this way. 10 centimeter. I am showing again. I will clear that I am showing inches here because I want to show you very clear the numbers here on the board on big size. But you will use the scale and in that centimeter only you will use. 10 centimeter line second you will draw at zero at one. Two, three, four, five. So what we have six, seven, eight, nine, ten. This way, ten parts of it you will make mark. Then as this number is uh, starting from three point something, so it is greater than three but less than four. So we will show here three, and here we will show four. So every part of it, it will show three. 3.7. Our answer near to our number is 3.7. This point is. So there we will make the mark that this point, this mark is showing 3.7. And just after that it is 3.8. So the given number is between these two. So now we will put the magnifying glass here. This way we will show that magnifying glass we put. If you show magnifying glass over it. It will look larger, and that larger part you have to show down to it. This is again drawing a 10 centimeter length line segment, and making the mark on every centimeter. So we have to stretch here, and 3.8 we have to show here by applying using magnifying glass. So this point is for us is 3.7 now, and this point is for us is 3.8. Again, 3.7 and 3.8 are divided to 10 equal parts. So this 3.7 after that these are all. Tenth part of it, 3.71, 3.72, 3.73, 3.74, 3.75, 3.76, 7, 8, 9, 3.8. So, which number do you want now? See the number 3.76. Where it will be 3.75 is this directly we can say. And after that, this is 3.76. This 3.75. This 3.76. And after that, 3.77. So our number is between 3.76 and 3.77, right? Again, using magnifying glass, you can magnify it this way. And that magnified part, this small part, magnified part, you can show down to it. So I again the 10 centimeter and line segment. Now in this 
3.76 magnified part is this way on left hand we will show and on right hand 3.77 we will show here so this is 3.76 this end and this end has 3.77 now our number is 3.765 so this is 3.76 1 3.762, 3.763, This mark is showing 3.765. This is the given number, and we have shown it on number line. To show it, we will make this way the point darker, some darker, and this way also we can show. This is the asked number which we wanted to. Uh, visualize on the number line, so this is 3.765 visualized on the number line. Okay. So after the point, how many digits you will have on that much step, you will get your real number on the number line. So after the point, three digits are there, so on third step you are getting your number on the number line. In that example, previous example 11, you have seen five decimal places were there. So on fifth line you will get you are getting your real number on the number line. Here how many digits we have? Up to four decimal places. So question two. Visualize 4.26 bar on the number line up to four decimal places. Up to four decimal places that is 4.26 is repeating so 2626. After the point four digits should be there. So after the point four digits we have. So now we can conclude after doing two examples, one example and one question. You will understand now that our this number <coughs> will be on the fourth step. So one by one step we will do. So here again 10 centimeter. The line segment I will draw with the marks on every centimeter this way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. On fourth number, so directly four lines I am going here for four line segments of 10 cm I am going here. On fourth line I will get my answer. So 10 cm again. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Fifth number is somewhat bigger than that. Then again 10 cm. 1 cent, 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And fourth step where we will get our answer 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, Now, <clears throat> first of all, the first digit of, from the left side is 4. 0.2626, that means this number is greater than 4, but less than 5. <clears throat> so here we will show 4, and here we will show 5. Now, <clears throat> this is the 4.26. So 4.2, where we will have, this is 4.0.4.1, 4.2. Is this number? 4.2. Just after that, it will show 4.3. So our digit, our number is between 4.2 and 4.3. <coughs> Putting magnifying glass on over it, it will be magnified and becoming large. And this large number we have to show on the next line, 4.2 here and 4.3 here. Make it clear by stretching this way. Again 4.2 and 4.3 have 10 equal parts <coughs> and our number is 4.26 now. So this is 4.20, 4.21, 4.22, 4.23, 4.24, 4.25, 4.26. This point. So here we will write 4.26 it is and after just after that is 4.27 and our number is between greater than 4.26 but less than 4.27 
again by magnifying glass putting over it it will be large and large part will show on the next line this will be 4.26 showing this will be 4.27 showing and 10 parts of it will show in the next step 4.26 stretching here and 4.27 stretching here now the next third digit we will see it is 4.262 so where will be the 4.262? This is 4.26, this is 4.261, 4.262 is this number, is this point. On the number line, this is showing 4.262. And just after that will be 4.263. Our number, given number, is between these two. So again we will put the magnifying glass over it and this will be becoming large. So this 4.262 here we will stretch and 4.263 here we will write and stretching we will show this way that this part only we have shown on the next and magnified part we have shown again between the these two parts this is shown and 10 parts of it done now which number we want 4.2626 this is 4.262 this is 4.2621 4.262 4.2623, 4.2624, 4.2625, This point on the number line you will have as 4.2626, which is asked in the question and we have shown it on the number line. This is the point. This way, every point, every real number can be represented on the number line by successive magnification method. This way, you are given an exercise. Only two questions we have and both we have solved here. And you are advisable to do it two or three times at uh, home in, as a homework. You do the example 11 also two or three times for your practice. And this question 1 and 2 also not only one time, two three times you solve it. You do this way. So it will be very easy for you. You will be confident in representing the real number of the number.